Hi, and welcome to today's Tuesday Tip. Today we're going to go over some things that the staff can do to help. The REACT inspection. First of all, staff needs to know the scope of work that's involved, which includes knowing how many hours it's gonna take your maintenance to do it, the material that will be needed to make the repairs, the cost of the materials to make the repairs. Also, staff needs to have what we're calling a code list for the inspection. A for acceptable. TI for take immediate action. C for can wait or will be in the preventive maintenance plan. RD for resident damage and RM for ready or repairs made. That code will kind of help you keep up with the repairs, but now you can't do a code or have a code without doing inspections. That means you're going to have to inspect the units. So often I have maintenance tell me, well, managers never inspect the units with us. We go on their own. You know what React's looking for, and sometimes maintenance doesn't, so it should be a team effort for you all to go out together. Conduct the inspections and the walkthroughs together, and remember, you cannot manage a property sitting in a chair behind, at a desk, you know, not going out to see what's on the property. You have to physically be on that property to know what's happening. I want to remind you that next week we have a special guest. Yes. So if you have a REACT inspection coming up or if you just want to get ready and be prepared, definitely tune in next week for Tuesday Tip Live when we have our expert with us. Thank you and we'll see you next week for a Tuesday Tip Live.